New at 11, we all know the headache of bad traffic, but travelers going across the Ohio are in for a surprise. After months of painting and closures on the Clark Memorial Bridge, there are now new closures on the I-65 bridge. Jesse Cohen is here with the details. Jesse. Well, Paulina, this is the view we had while driving over the John F. Kennedy Bridge on I-65 just a little while ago. But remember, this was taken on a Saturday, not during rush hour, so we got through pretty smoothly. But the cones on the bridge narrow as you cross, removing three lanes of traffic going south. So we told people in Indiana about what we saw while driving over it today, and to say the least, they weren't happy. The commute over the Ohio River is a daily activity for hundreds. I go twice a day five times a week. But many people on the Indiana side didn't realize what was coming. I, I was totally shocked because I have to travel from Elizabethtown all the way up here. Honestly, it's just going to frustrate a lot of people. Three lanes across the John F. Kennedy Bridge are closed for repairs from now until the day before Thanksgiving. Just that extra just one lane of traffic across a bridge, it's going to wreck things. Some are saying time couldn't be worse. We got Thanksgiving and Christmas coming up and finals, so <laughs> I'm trying to make it to finals all on time. That's going to be rough now. And others say their commute just got a whole lot longer. See, my commute's already 27 to 30 minutes, so if you added that on top of it, I think it, I would probably end up taking off work. <laughs> I'm not going to be waking up at six. I'm going to be waking up like five in the morning to get up here and it, it, it just stinks already. And my boss is like, you better get to work early. In these commuters eyes, it's a recipe for a traffic disaster. It's going to be real rough. It's just going to cause a nightmare. I think this is going to be a big change. Now, the reason it's being shut down for this time is because of an expansion of joint repair, which does not affect the structural integrity of the bridge. Now, the Kentucky Transportation Cabinet says the dates and durations of the work may be adjusted due to weather or other unforeseen delays. So with possible bad weather in the forecast this upcoming week, there's no telling what could happen. For the night team, I'm Jesse Cullen.